Alright, I'm doing Skywars, and I'm not going to do an intro, because if you do do an intro, like, you're going to lose, like, 50% of your audience right off the bat. And uh, from experience, I can tell you it's not a great way to start off a video, let alone an entire YouTube campaign. Jump. There we go. Really, that's my advice for anyone who's starting a new YouTube channel. Don't, like, bore... Also, don't get, like, dubstep intros. They will not make you go far in life. Can you please get off? Thank you. Did you... No. Why would you take that fall damage? You had a chance, my man. And then you then you died. Give me this, give me this. Dude, I'm I'm about to politely disagree with this guy. Unless this guy's down here. Well, that was a close fight. Um can I hit you off? Well, that was a pretty close fight. Oh, this is one of the new maps, isn't it? Anyway, so I'm going to tell the grand old story of how I thought I had, um, you know... Actually, I can't say because I'm not monetized. I thought I had COVID. Anyway, me and my father, we were going on this, like, trip across America. We were flying to, like, Minneapolis and then driving to Sacramento. And, like, hey, driving to Sacramento from Minneapolis is a big deal. Also, we had to fly from Minneapolis, or, uh, NC to Minneapolis. Can't really get much more specific than that. You cannot do what you're doing, please. Well, I asked him nicely, and he snapped. Anyway, yeah, we were doing, like, a whole trip around the USA, and we were starting in Minneapolis. We went to Sacramento, and then we took a train all the way back from Sacramento. You guys are going to have strength, aren't you? That was the actually most effective poison potion I could have gotten. You can get off the edge, and I don't have pearls, so I was not very effective. I'm totally going to lose this fight unless I can actually hit my shots. I'm actually totally about to get screwed over. Because, oh my god, how long does this poison last? Another 16... Wait, what? I don't know. Okay, just leave me alone while I find healing. So we were in... Um, was it Montana? Actually, I don't remember. You're coming for me. It was either Montana or... I think it was Wyoming. But we had to stay in this really like, like small cabin. It was... Ba where did you go? It was basically a triplex. Did you pearl away? I think so. But it was basically a triplex... And the walls were, like, so thin. And since, we were, since it's Wyoming, obviously, everything... That was actually sort of effective. Everything is really windy. So naturally, like, I'm a, I get car sick a lot. I'm prone to that kind of stuff. Did you really do that? This guy's witch is better than he is. I don't even, I don't even have any healing either. Why hacks, he says. I don't know, man. It's just a hobby. Give me this. Really? That's impressive, honestly. So, so it was, like, the middle of the night... Anyway, around that time I started to feel sick, which isn't great, because we were like in the middle of, we were in the middle of Wyoming, like we were pretty close to Yellowstone, and it, like there wasn't really, like, like there wasn't anything we could do, because I mean there was a store, but, I, plus this was like the middle of COVID, so if I, like, like if I had gone out to get something, they would be like, oh, dude, you have COVID, get out, so, yo, what are you doing, what are you guys doing, can you guys not, I'm gonna get third party, aren't I, no, you can get off the edge, and you can do the exact same thing that he just did. So I had to just lay in bed, and I watched, like, movies on my phone, because... I mean, the thing about being sick is it's a lot better whenever you have some sort of distract, Like, an iPad or, like, something to watch maybe YouTube on. You have, like, literally no armor whatsoever, my dude. But you do have every mob in existence. Do you like my strength? <laughs> yeah, I deserve that kill. So I kept feeling sick, but I actually managed to go to sleep. And, like, sometimes whenever you get sick, like, you, you just go into denial. Like, I'm not going to vomit or anything. I'm just like, this must be, like, some sort of placebo. I, I ate, like, chicken, like, three to four days ago. It, that Apparently, I'm allergic to chicken now. That's, that's, that's what I can draw from this experience. But no, like, I was ready to vomit at that point. Because I have, like, uh, I have, like, a phobia or whatever. I don't like vomiting. Uh, hello. Anyway, okay, I hope he- yeah. If that guy had made it, he would have killed me easily. I have no pants. I have no healing. I have no healing. Give me this. That wasn't a- Oh my god, I'm so bad! I thought I was toggling my, uh, my eggs, but I put my, uh... Dude, I have strength. You don't want to mess with this. Actually, no, I don't have strength. It doesn't quite matter. You're dead anyway. You're not, I'm not getting much commentary out of this. I'm 
too focused on killing people. So I wasn't sick, which is good. I feel like I got a theory. If I had stayed awake, I probably would have vomited at some point. And then we would have had to cut our trip short. Which should be... <laughs> Wyoming is not a great place to get sick, I'll tell you that right now. Especially with a literal pandemic. <sighs> yeah. It's bad news. Anyway, so I was actually fine. And a week later, we went to the beach, and then something came up. And so we had to go to West Virginia, which is where my parents are from. And we got to stay with my uncle. He's a cool guy. You're not gonna... Oh, you actually are going to survive. Okay, well, time to fake you. That was way more effective than I thought it would be. I'm not looting. I'm just going to kill this guy now. Wait, you don't have any health. And you have very high ping. Okay, that's fine. So we had to go to West Virginia. Okay. So we had to go to West Virginia and stay with my uncle. And the thing is, he... My cousin, he has a girlfriend. <laughs> He's like 17. It's not like a... Not like a joke. But yeah, he has a girlfriend, and um, we were at like a picnic or something, and then she she couldn't attend it because she thought she had a migraine, which is like, that's a reasonable reason to not go to it. Like, I'm not, not making fun of her or anything. But yeah, that's a reasonable reason to not go to something. The worst part is then she developed a low-grade fever. Get into the void, please. I need you to do that. Okay. So at that point, we realized that she might have COVID, which, for obvious reasons, and we were in West Virginia. Like, there's Wyoming and there's West Virginia. It's like the two lowest GDPs in the country, and we happen to have some sicknesses in them. Actually, I can, I can hit you in, can I? I can. Great. It was hard to get her tested because tests are just, like, not something that's easy to do. This guy's not being very efficient. Anyway, so yeah, we had all worried that she had COVID. So we, we didn't leave early. We just le we left at a normal time. And it's like an eight-hour drive from West Virginia to North Carolina, so... Guess what? Car sickness again. My brother was gonna go to like a summer camp for the summer, which you figure he wouldn't do because it's COVID, but we actually didn't get to go because she might have COVID and we were that she, she might have given it to us. We got to stay home for a while. I mean, I wasn't going to camp anyway, but it was fun. And the good news is we realized she didn't have COVID. So I had two COVID scares in two different states with two really, are you serious? Actually, I could totally hit you off now. <laughs> That's so epic. Can you not? I'm gonna get pearls and I'm gonna hurt your feelings. Can you not? Can I please have some pearls? Can I please have- Are you serious? I get a power one bow. Great. I could- Is he just AFK? Wow, that was a worthy kill. You should subscribe. It's not really a request, it's a demand. Bye!